गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रन वेलकम टू द सोशल स्टडीज क्लास चिल्ड्रन इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई हैड एक्सप्लेन चैप्टर सेवन केयर एंड कंपैशन चिल्ड्रन आई हैड एक्सप्लेन अबाउट पीपल विद डिफरेंसेस एंड ओल्ड एंड सिक पीपल children no two persons are exactly the same in this world every single person is unique or different we also learned that old people need lot of care and support from us we also learned how to take care of old people children today i am going to continue the same lesson chapter 7 care and compassion and the topic which i am going to discuss are the first topic is differently abled people and disability awareness the second topic under privileged people so we are going to study about differently abled people and ability awareness children kindly take out your book page number 58 okay children first of all let us learn about differently abled people and disability awareness just like we are all born with differences in the way we look and the way we act some people are born with differences in the way their body works or how their brain works there are many people around us who may have difficulties in walking listening seeing or speaking they may use wheelchairs or walk on crutches what is the meaning of crutches it is a long stick used as a support by a lame person you can see these are crutches such people often need help on the roads in schools and in public places we should be aware of their problems and try to help them in every possible way there are various things which we can do to help differently abled people let us see first one we should give them space to walk children differently abled people may use wheelchairs or crutches to go to different places so they need space we should give them space to walk second point we should assist blind people on the roads we should help blind people on the roads or in public places children blind people can read 
special books this is called braid they have raised dots in the form of letters which can allow blind people to read people with hearing problems use hearing machines or sign languages next point we should offer them seats on buses and trains next point we should let them go first in lifts or on stairs we should give them chance to go first next one we should help them in carrying things children before helping such people we should always ask if they want any help children now let us discuss the second topic underprivileged people children there are underprivileged people in our country too there are many people who are poor we can see them on the streets many poor people work in other people's home to earn money their children do not go to school or play with toys and wear fancy clothes such people are called underprivileged people we should be aware of their problems and not make fun of such people we should try and help them in every possible way children what can you do to help children from poor families you can donate old books old clothes and toys to them in this way you can help children from underprivileged family children now let us look page number 58 there is a question given here list five things that you can do with your grandparents or old relative every week kind children some space is provided you can see in the picture how some children are spending time with their grandparents you can write like this number 1 i can play with my grandparents second i can hear stories from story books number 3 i can do my studies with the help of my grandmother and number 4 i can learn to make craft things so you can write only four i hope children you have understood today's lesson you have to read the lesson well complete this question on page number 58 that's all for today Thank you